guys, what's going on? It's me, Joy. Um, today, the topic is going to be about giving second chances. Um, I think we all should strive to give second chances to people. Um, every situation is different, but it doesn't dispute the fact that we all need to have a second chance. So let's think about it this way. Our parents gave us multiple chances um, either while we were in adolescence or just in life. They didn't throw us away because we made them upset or disappointed us or, or disappointed them. Uh, maybe some parents did, but not all do. Um, everybody's case is a little different. I understand that. But it doesn't negate the fact that they gave a second chance, right? So you may come uh, across people who, you know, uh, offend you or hurt your feelings or do things that you feel were really harsh or wrong, but it doesn't, it doesn't give you a reason to not give them a second chance. Um, you say, why? Because if you haven't caught on to what I've been saying for the longest, we need to let pride go because pride is what keeps us from doing a lot of things that could cause healing to others and yourself. So I say we should all start giving people second chances. Now, what about me? Oh, absolutely. I'll give people second, third, fourth, fifth, 20th chances because my mindset is that I'm pretty sure I've been given plenty of retakes when I probably didn't deserve it or didn't understand that I didn't deserve it. And just thinking about that makes me thankful and I appreciate those individuals, whether I know it or not. And so it's best to pass on that same thing to others. Ooh. So it's really not that cold outside. Sorry to... Um, go off topic a little bit. It's not that cold, but I'm a weirdo and that's okay. I'm cool because I am a weirdo and I will take that any day. But anyway, second chances. I want you now to think of all the people that you may have thrown away or stopped talking to because you felt like you didn't need to give them a second chance. Think about the situation that caused whatever hurt or trauma to your relationship. Think about ways that you can resolve the issue in a respectful way. You know, maybe the relationship or friendship, whatever. When I say relationship, I mean just in general, covers everything, whatever you're personally going through. I don't know, but whatever trauma that may have been caused, think about, is it really worth losing that person forever? And is my pride really that that desperate and strong and obnoxious where I can't give them a second chance? No, that's the answer. No, it's always a good thing to give people second chances. So once you've thought of the people, persons, or even yourself, because sometimes we don't give ourselves second chances at things, you may start a project and you may have fallen off a little bit, but you want to give up because it didn't go the way you wanted it to go. But that's not up to you to give up because you got people like myself saying, give yourself a second chance and do it over. Nothing like a good do-over, right? Do-overs are amazing. So think about it. If you that headstrong or persistent and thinking that it's not okay to give people second chances, just remember those chances that you were given when you didn't even know you deserved it or didn't deserve it. So take that to where it needs to go. And remember, always give people second chances, no matter what. So what? Pride is the only thing that keeps you from happiness. So what? Just give in and allow things to be mended and healed.
You deserve it for yourself and, and everyone else that it affects. Now, what about giving second chances to someone that has robbed you? Well, I say if they're willing to apologize and pay back, then why not, right? You just hope that they don't do it again. And that's the expectation that you both have um, decided is what you need to move forward if the relationship begins or continues. How about if someone said something about you that you didn't appreciate? Tell them and then give them a second chance. Give them a second to go over so I can give you a second chance to listen to what I have to say, right? <laughs> anyway, I do all of this because I feel like in order for the world to be a better place, in order for the world to be where I believe it can be, we got to start healing and stop letting pride get in the way of all of that. Yes, I believe we are all very prideful, but it takes a lot more humility to admit when you are wrong and when you have offended and when you can approach somebody, even if they offended you, when you can approach somebody and say, hey, this is what you did to me and still give them a second chance, kudos to you because that shows that you're a strong individual or individuals. So I'm going to leave you now because I don't want to make it too long, but I hope you have a beautiful week. I hope that it is amazing. I hope that you have peace. I hope that your work environment is amazing. And I hope that your life environment is amazing. And <laughs> I hope that you live life full of fun, have a lot of laughs, and enjoy whatever you do. Have a good week. Until next time, I hope that I've inspired you because you certainly inspire me. Bye.